All right, excellent first class. I saw that shit yesterday morning. Um, you know, movies, superhero movies that focus too much on the non superhero part and more on the wait, did I say it wrong? Movies that focus more on the non superhero part, wait. Yeah, 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 and not much on the superhero part pisses me off. But X Men, they had a good balance of it, you know, because you know it's, it's about the first class and they're they're trying to, the movie movie was about explaining how the X Men got to be where, where where they are and shit I didn't know about because you know I'm not I'm not a super X Men fan. I, know I watch the TV shows and the, uh, the cartoons and shit. I never like I never like try to figure out how, how they started and like uh, how how the Professor X get get in a wheelchair and shit. But um, but I guess now I know now and. Try to figure out who the red guy was, and they said it was he was Nightcrawler's uh, father and shit. I mean that was a movie. That I, 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 that was a movie. I read that shit online and shit. But um, first it was a good fucking movie, but you know they had like it was like a part in the middle where they just stopped the whole movie and just focused on love and romance. You know, X Men every X Men movie gotta be like, oh the humans don't accept us uh, for like an hour long, and you're like, okay, get on with the fucking movie. We understand you don't you're not accepted by humankind. Get on with the movie. I, I know it's an important feature of X Men, but we get it. The humans don't like you. Stop dragging that shit on. Just they kept on dragging it on though. I'm like I was sitting there like, okay, when is movie gonna keep start starting again? Cause cause it, it was about Mystique and shit. I know cause it's more cause in the, in, the, in, the, in the other three movies, uh, Mystique is like she really hates humans and shit. You know she hates them a lot. And you you see here why and like she, you know this is her like she she's starting the the gears are starting to turn watching hate humans and shit. But fuck man, it was it was a good fucking movie you know they, you know they uh they gave us some hints about the old one and shit they had the little little cameos of the other guys and shit you know he was trying to find everybody and shit but I'm not, I'm not I'm not spoiling not spoiling not spoiling not spoiling but it was a good fucking movie um it was a good mix but. It went a little slow in the middle about all the non superhero shit. But good fucking movie, uh. I give it two thumbs up. Go see it if you want to. If you're in the X Men, if you like the other X Men. It was way better than three, way better than three, because three had so much slow shit. I'm like, come on, guys, really? You know, people, like big ass people here that don't even show off their powers. And this movie showed off people's powers. The people that, that's new and shit, it showed the powers and shit. Because people that, I guess, that was in first class, uh, comic books and shit, they. they they had some good powers in there. They showed them off, you know. They had little fight scenes and shit. You know, I was like, all right, okay, I get it, I get it, I get it. But um, if you if you like X Men, go see it. And if you don't, don't go see it. But it was a good fucking movie. Good action. Too much plot again, but it wasn't an, enough plot to make me go, okay, this movie sucks. It just, it just stopped. But it was a pretty good movie. Um, two thumbs up. Go see it now if you want to. Bye.